my god, Keaton's face behind you when you walked on stage? <laughs> I was shitting myself. <laughs> He was shitting himself. <laughs> that dude owes me. My dear, what if I told you that the entire fate of our production rests upon your slender shoulders? <laughs> I've never had an experience like that on stage. Yeah, right? You No, were... you. Like, seriously. I love nights after a show. <laughs> Is it always like this? Oh, totally. It's such a high. No more nerves, just the adrenaline. So, first timer, are you proud of yourself? Yeah, I feel really awesome. If you told me this morning I'd be this happy tonight, You've gone through so much shit today. Right now is pretty good. Okay, the whole show was good. I admit it. Yeah. <laughs> it was magical. Well... <laughs> Everything's been magical since we started hanging out. Let's leave. For real. For real, huh? You said you wanted to skip town and never look back. Like I said last night, let's do it. <laughs> I know. I've been thinking about that all day. But that was... <laughs> Don't say it was just a crazy thought. You mean it. I can tell. You want this. Yeah, but... Like... Eventually. Let's go now. Didn't we already agree on stage? We can't just... <laughs> Why not? I know our parents have been shitty, but we can't just... Leave them. That doesn't sound like Chloe Price. But I'm the only one my mom has left. You're right. What am I saying? She's got David now. What about money? I thought you were a high-rolling criminal now. I've got the money I took from Drew's, but... Rachel, I feel terrible about what happened. Maybe we can give it back. Or pay that Damon guy off. Yeah. Maybe. We'll figure it out, Chloe. Anyway, I've got more than enough to start us out. I always get birthday money for my dad. Or should I say, hush money. Any more questions? How far could we possibly get without a car? I thought you were fixing that truck in the junkyard. I was just seeing if I could. Well, can you or can't you? Yeah, I can. 
That's hot. In other words, we've got transportation covered. <sighs> Fine then, drama queen. Where are we going? <laughs> you tell me. What uniquely twisted location does Chloe Price plus Rachel Amber equal? Hmm. <laughs> Hell, New York City. Obviously. 3 a.m., you and me outside some cafe on St. Mark's, shoving pizza in our mouths and shouting Broadway songs with ten people we just met. And this cute guy in horn-rimmed glasses will pass by and see you and slow down. Yeah, okay. He'll be like, want to split a cab? And I'll be like, back off. She's with me. You're full of shit. <laughs> I love this time of night. <laughs> Don't you just feel like everything's possible? <laughs> Rachel, stop. If you don't mean this, it's, it's just making me feel like shit that this life you're describing isn't going to happen. For fuck's sake! I've never been more serious in my life. <laughs> <sighs> Chloe, what would it take to convince you? How about, um... Oh. Is that convincing enough? Yeah. <sighs> Holy shit. Right? What is this stuff? I think it's a sign. I think we should leave tonight. Really? If you want to, I'm ready. Let's go sneak some clothes and stuff from my house. And then we'll get the hell out of Arcadia Bay. That sounds perfect. <laughs>